At present, it is impossible to imagine the global iron and steel industry and blast furnace production without hot stoves developed by Yakov Kalugin, an outstanding Russian scientist and engineer. An active introduction of top combustion or shaftless stoves of Kalugin design KSS started in 2000, when the company established by Yakov Kalugin entered the world market of metallurgical equipment. In 2012, the company was headed by Marina Kalugin. Today, the company takes a world-leading position in designing of top combustion stoves and waste heat recovery systems. Nowadays, more than 30% of the Russian hot metal and 10% of the world hot metal is produced with the use of Kalugin shaftless stoves. The specific feature of Kalugin shaftless stoves is their capability to provide the hot blast temperature up to 1350 degrees Celsius, which is about 100 to 150 degrees Celsius higher than the temperature provided by all other known stove designs. KSS is characterized by small capital expenditures for construction, higher reliability of operation, environmental friendliness and cost efficiency. This is ensured by a unique stove design with a burner at the top of the dome. Due to these characteristics of Kalugin's equipment, the blast furnace operators can significantly reduce consumption of coke, thereby improving the performance of each individual blast furnace and the entire iron making process. The burner device is arranged at the top of the dome along the center line of the hot stove. The stove has a pre-chamber and jet vortex supply of gas and air. A vortex of gas and air jets ensures intensive mixing and combustion of gas in the middle part of the dome before burned gases enter the checker work. The jet vortex burner ensures concentration of carbon monoxide in waste gas below 50 mg per cubic meter, which is less than the European standards, and the so-called short circuit is completely eliminated in Kalugin shaftless stoves. Therefore, over the entire period of operation, the Kalugin stoves remain ecologically clean. Moreover, the values of hazardous emissions into the atmosphere conform to the most stringent environmental standards. Flame pulsation during combustion is completely eliminated in Kalugin stove design. There is no flame impingement against the brickwork and local overheating, which provides symmetric distribution of temperatures over the dome, checkerwork, refractory lining and shell. As a result, thermal stresses are reduced and stove durability is improved. Especially for Kalugin stoves, we developed checker bricks with a hole diameter of 30 mm and 20 mm. The use of 20 mm checker bricks and the removal of the combustion chamber from the stove design made it possible to reduce the checker work height by 40 to 50 percent, keeping the same heat capacity of the stove. Distribution of zones made of different refractory bricks over the checker work height is calculated in such a way that there are no conditions for hole clogging with dust and slag. Therefore, over the entire period of operation, the checker work with holes of any diameter remains clean. So, construction of small Kalugin stoves enables to save 30-40% on the cost of refractory materials, as compared to internal combustion stoves of the same heat capacity. The checker support system of Kalugin shaftless stoves has a beamless design with independent support of each grid by its own column. As a result, the grids do not influence each other at temperature fluctuations. The maximum waste gas temperature in the checker support of this design can be increased from 400 to 500 degrees Celsius, which enables to decrease the checker work height and increase the waste gas temperature for gas and air preheating in the waste heat recovery system.
At Iron and Steel Plants all over the world, construction of collagen shuffless stoves is accompanied by implementation of different waste heat recovery systems developed by Kalugin's engineers. At some collagen stove units, both fuel, gas and combustion air are preheated in the waste heat recovery system. To provide the hot blast temperature of 1300 degrees Celsius with blast furnace gas of a low calorific value and without addition of a high calorie gas, blast furnace gas is preheated to the temperature of 200 degrees Celsius in the heat pipe heat exchanger and combustion air is preheated to the temperature of 600 degrees Celsius. Nowadays, the heat exchanger design based on heat pipes is the most popular design of the waste heat recovery system developed by Kelvin's engineers. All the designs of the waste heat recovery system are all general purpose. They can be efficiently used in iron and steel industry, heat and electric power industry, machine building industry, construction material production, chemical and petrochemical industry in all industries where low-grade waste gases with a temperature up to 300 degrees Celsius are available. Its actual operation of Colgan shuffless stoves reveals the service life of the stoves without major repairs is minimum 30 years. On this basis, Leading blast furnace operators in iron and steel industry all over the world have duly appreciated the advantages of this design and opted for Kalugin shuffless stoves. When developing technical documentation for hot stoves and waste heat recovery systems, Kalugin's engineers perform scientific and technical expertise, computer-based simulation and full complex of thermal engineering and hydraulic resistance calculations for the project. High reliability of the designs is also ensured through supply of high-quality equipment and refractory materials. At all stages of project implementation, Kalugin's engineers render technical supervision services and control quality of construction and commissioning works. Moreover, at the final stages of project implementation, the company provides training for the customer's operators and assists them in commissioning of the stoves. Kalugin Company continues successful cooperation with the world's biggest iron and steel companies. Every year, new Kalugin shuffless stoves are put in operation all over the world. Thus, three Kalugin stove units designed by Kalugin Company have already been constructed in companies designed at Yevraz and TNK, iron and steel plant in Russia. In 2017, advanced checker bricks with a 20 mm hole diameter were used in construction of the third Kalugin stove unit, which made it possible to decrease stove dimensions and consequently reduce the total cost of the construction project. In 2017, at Magnitogorsk Iron and Steel Works MMK, the company's engineers commissioned new stove number 23 piece included in the stove system of blast furnace number 7. During the project implementation, a new infrastructure of the entire stove system was developed. It is planned thereby to construct two new Kalugin stoves in place of the existing stoves without interruption of blast furnace operation. In Japan, two Kalugin shuffless stoves designed by Kalugin company have already been commissioned at blast furnace number 3 of 4,300 cubic meters capacity and blast furnace number 4 of 5,000 cubic meters of GFE Steel Corporation in Fukuyama. Now at blast furnace number 3, one by one a reconstruction of the next stoves is performed. A stove unit consisting of three stoves was constructed at smelting furnace number 2 of MFCL in Kurashiki. Moreover, at the biggest European iron and steel plants show much interest in the company's technology. In 2017, Europe's first Kalugin shuffless stove designed by Kalugin company was commissioned at Trinet's Iron and Steel Works in Czech Republic. After implementation of this project, the company received orders for designing of new KSS. 
Thus, cooperation with Kalugin company is the right choice for developing and increasing efficiency of blast furnace production.